This is the beginning of, um, of a series of five CDs, CD recordings. Um, so it's all about the duos uh, by Schubert and Brahms, the duos for piano and other instrument. Uh, so there are seven sonatas by Brahms and there are nine pieces by Schubert, most of them for violin and piano. Most of the pieces that we are playing are not originally for cello and piano. We also play, let's say, transcriptions that Peter transcribed himself from the clarinet sonatas from Brahms, also the violin sonatas of Brahms. Schubert has not written any piece for cello. I mean, the piece which is most played is the arpeggione, and even that is not meant, so to say, for the, for the cello. This time we uh, decided to do this uh, project uh, on uh, so-called modern instruments. So I'm, I'm playing on a Steinway. And as uh, someone who lives in the beginning of uh, the 21st century, it is so much part of uh, our musical ear. So somehow, for me, it feels like a limitation to have to make a choice, especially based on that so-called so kind of do dogmatic idea that one can uh, only play uh, uh, Schubert uh, on a fortepiano because this was the instrument of Schubert. Yeah. No, music is a living thing. A beautiful Steinway is a beautiful instrument. Uh, my, my Guadagnini cello is beautiful with gut strings, but equally great with steel strings. So um, we opted for the modern instruments this time. It started almost 25 years ago and I was uh, finishing my studies at the Conservatory in Amsterdam and uh, Peter Wispelwey was a very famous uh, cellist and I suddenly got a call from his manager that he was uh, in dire need for a pianist. He was still a student when, when I asked him to play with me. Uh, there, there, was a, there was an emergency situation and he, he stepped in. I said right away yes, and also I said uh, to the pieces that were asked that they were all repertoire, no problem. And as soon as I uh, put down the telephone, I rushed to the music store to get them because uh, <laughs> they were actually all new for me and I practiced, uh, practiced really hard in the entire night. Uh, and that is how it started, two days later in a beautiful village in the Alsace in France, we had our first concert. On every volume of this five disc set, there will be at least one work that I think has not been recorded before. So on, on the first volume, it's the, um, the second clarinet sonata by Brahms, or viola sonata. I don't think it has been done before. Um, the next volume, there will be the, the, the flute variations on cello. It should be a world premiere. Um, then there's the, of course, there's the um, A major, Opus 100, Brahms sonata, the second one, which I think is um, the first.
Schubert and Brahms being my favorite composers probably comes down to the fact that they, they, they both have this endless um, lyrical quality um, and, and that's of course attractive to, uh, to a cellist. I understand the longing of a fantastic musician to, to embrace this entire, entire world. <laughs>